Okay, this one for you. This is for you. How much? One dollar twenty cent. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, no, no, ten, ten cents. Oh, ten cents. Ah. Ah. Okay. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Very tasty. Eh? Okay, today we are doing this survey eh? and I want a lot of people to reply to all the survey. Uh, Cheleng, uh, gate, eh? you jaga the gate. People coming in, coming out, you survey. Okay, within two hours. Eh? Uh, you, Kuda, see car park there? See you not? Kasha, never mind. You with me. Uh, we get the Kasha. Go! Waiting for what? One out. You, you know me. <sighs> yep, yep. Okay. Hey, sorry, 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 man, I'm late. Sorry. Oh, thanks, thanks for coming, you. thanks for coming. You should come, sir. I think this place is not very well ventilated. Oh. No, it's okay, it's okay. Uh, please uh, get this, uh, some of the document outside and take care of the telephone. And can you get for me a coffee, please? Now, now. So, uh, I'll let uh, Tasha do the okay. presentation. So, so, that's the gatekeeper, you know, mm. basically someone who plays favourites. Uh. Yeah, I think uh, Wayfa was uh, speaking about uh, playing right. favourites just mm -hmm, now. Uh, that's right. Especially in the army, right? Yeah, saying. Okay. Yeah. Mm. And it's quite annoying because uh, what happens is they facilitate assess for some people in the workplace and you know get them to go up the corporate ladder but yet you know they will deny access to others so mm. if you happen to be the one who is not favored by the boss how would you feel like, have you been in a circumstance where you are not favored by the boss <laughs> he thinks he's to be laughing she's like yeah. oh, is that me <laughs> pray that the boss will get transferred out <laughs> Wait, but are you the gatekeeper are you are, yeah. are you I was never up the corporate ladder. Yeah, not <laughs> yet, not yet. Yes. A rising star, you see. <laughs> mm. If you are not exactly favoured by the boss, mm -hmm. I mean, all you can do is... I mean, it, it, that depends on whether you have passion for the job. Mm -hmm. If you have passion for the job, stay on, continue to work hard, motivate yourself. Mm -hmm. Try to find out exactly what the boss expects of you and mm -hmm. work towards that. Okay. If you have no passion for the job, okay, leave. Mm -hmm. Join another company, join a new industry. So um, start basically, over again. Yeah, if you have the passion, then you bother yes, to find out correct. the boss's preferences and work yes. around him, yeah. work around correct. the tyrant, uh, mm. whoever it is. Mm. Yeah, but what if you are the person who is favoured? I mean, like uh, Tasha in this case, and uh, would you allow you know this sort of situation to continue to prevail, mm. or would you stand up for the other colleague who is bullied? Yeah. Okay, mm. you guys, what are your thoughts? Yeah. I will let it prevail. <laughs> Actually, in the workplace, it's very common that you don't stand up for anyone else. Mm. Sometimes you know mm. that, oh, this person may be right, but just keep quiet. Why do you think this is so, though? Oh, protect yourself. Oh. And also, why make my own life difficult? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. But mm. in a way, then you are uh, complicit, right? Like, you are allowing the bullying situation mm. to continue, and therefore, you have also become a bully. Okay, for right? me, I guess uh, there are some battles that you have mm. to pick. 
Oh, you know, okay. so you have to pick the right battles to fight for. You know, oh. if you fight the right battles, then you know, okay, okay you know, yeah. yeah. So okay, so if the boss is like about to you know retire or about to be retrenched by the company, then it's time to stand up for. A no, no, I think that. <laughs> I think when it comes to like workplace, especially especially when there, you have so many mm. uh, people together, mm-hmm. you have a lot of grey areas. Mm. Mm. Yeah, so grey mm. areas are uh, where you. You negotiate your own relationship with your colleague. Mm. You negotiate your own relationship with your boss, your superior, and your underling. Mm. You know, so I guess that's the. I mean, especially for people in financial consultants, mm. there's mm-hmm. a lot of uh, there's a lot of KPIs to meet. Mm-hmm. You know, so it's yeah. a very ultimately your your results are on paper. So mm-hmm. you know, I yeah, yeah. that's how I, how I see it. Uh. Okay, so mm. it's important to manage up as manage well up as, as well uh, manage down. retain your decency. Yeah, even while you are managing up. Maybe. Yeah, probably. Okay. So in the next segment, we'll look at a more uh, subtle form of bullying. Okay, maybe you don't even find it uh, a form of bullying. Okay, we'll find out in a while.